Me and Katie are actually hosting a big Halloween party at our apartment. For real? Nice. We miss you. Yeah. Happy birthday. Halloween weekend, baby. <laughs> so I'm able to make breakfast this morning before we go, which is good, so I don't faint at the workout class. Let's get ready. I don't think my hair has ever been greasier. I say that like every week, but it's bad today. So we're gonna slick it back for this workout, and then we can do an everything shower when we get back. So I don't even need any product for this sh so much more refreshed. I'm hungry. Let's make breakfast before we go to this class. And breakfast is served. I've been making this like every day the past few weeks because I feel like it's the perfect meal. It keeps me full for a long time. So good. Okay, time to get dressed for Orange Theory. I picked out a cute little workout outfit. I used to wear like the ugliest workout clothes to any class and to the gym, but now I'm like, you know what? I am way more excited to work out. Then I have something cute on. Let's get dressed. Okay, here is the workout fit. Sports bra is from Free People and so is this little zip up jacket. And then shorts are actually from Marshall. These are one of the comfiest shorts I've ever owned. You guys know I have strictly been running this whole summer so I haven't been to a workout class in a long time. If you've been watching me for a while, you know I was an Orange Theory stan and I still am, okay? Don't get me wrong, but I was training for the half marathon so I kind of took a hiatus on it for a little bit. But it is fall and it is time to go back. It's getting cold out, which means I can't run outside every day anymore. I mean, I could, but I would literally freeze. Now that I live in my new apartment, instead of driving, I can just easily take the bus to most places or the train. So I'm gonna take public transportation to get to Orange Theory. My class starts at 12.05 and it is 11.28. So I'm gonna leave in just a second to make sure I get there on time. Cracking an energy drink like 30 minutes before your workout is the perfect time. I feel like it hits right when it starts then. Lonnie sent me their Witches Brew energy drinks. This is one of my favorite flavors. Pink Slush is my favorite and then probably this. Honestly, afterwards, this one's so good if you haven't tried. They only sell them for like a limited time since they're like Halloween themed. They're caramel apple and they're just too good. But I'm all ready. We gotta catch the bus and we know how that usually works out for me. I always miss the bus. So we're leaving extra early because I'm not gonna be late to Orange Theory. Absolutely not. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I have been working all day and it is now 6.41. But now it is time to get ready because we are going out. Not really. We're going for like a literal casual drink. So I'm honestly not even gonna do a ton of makeup. I'm meeting my friend Katie Hafner. She's become one of my close friends here and I just love her. Me and Katie are actually hosting a big Halloween party at our apartment on Saturday and she's gonna be out of town so she unfortunately can't come. So we were like, let's catch up before you leave for the weekend. I honestly don't wanna do a lot of makeup at all. But sometimes getting ready to go out is like actually the fun part. Like I love getting ready. I think we're going to either Wills or a place on Southport Which if you live in Chicago probably know where both those places are. So we're just gonna quickly throw some makeup on I literally forgot 
forgot I had this top. I love the color, so I feel like I'm gonna go with this. Ugh, I hate that it's starting to get cold out. I don't know what jeans are gonna look best with this, so we might have to try a few different options. I don't know, I haven't been feeling high-rise jeans that much anymore, but it's kind of cold out, so I don't know if I wanna go with a crop top. Let's just see what looks good, honestly. I think I'm gonna go with this. I just paired it with these low-rise jeans. They're from Hollister. I think this is good enough. I don't really wanna try anything else because it sounds like a lot of effort, and like, who cares? Anyway, I'm going to call an Uber, and then we're gonna head out. The most me thing ever is that I just changed my outfit entirely because I was uncomfortable, but my Uber is here now. Hi, for Cora. <laughs> Can you yell at me? Is that what you want? <laughs> I don't know. I curated a girls' night. And if you're not at girls' night, I'm gonna be pissed. Because it's only the baddest, it's only the coolest, it's only the most fun people. Dude, don't worry. I don't want to go. I'm not gonna peer pressure you, but like, if you don't go, I'm gonna tell everybody that you have some weird disease. <laughs> okay, so what do I do? You're like, you come. It's girls' night. I told the boys they can't come. I need a feminine phenomenon. Uh, I do love a feminine phenomenon. <laughs> Dude, I literally have to be in River North at 745. Saturday. Find a place to sleep in River North. Ew. Yeah, I'm sorry to say anything. Let me decide. I don't want to wake up tomorrow and then feel shitty. Hey. <laughs> I literally am sitting in bed on my phone working and Katie really just comes to my room wearing this full ass costume. She was not wearing this 10 seconds ago when I was in her room talking to her. I actually think it's really cute though. It's like, I like that wear that tonight. I'm like, yeah, but do I see it? I'm cutting everything out. Hi. It is now Friday. It's the next day. I had a fun little night catching up with my friend Katie. It wasn't anything too crazy. We literally had one drink at the bar and then came back and I went to bed. And then this morning I woke up to a FaceTime from Nick trying to convince me to go out tonight. But I just don't want to be tired tomorrow. I have soul cycle class at literally 8 in the morning. So if I go out, I just feel like I'm going to die. And then I also have our party that we're hosting here. I decided I'm not going to go out. You guys saw the footage. He was really trying to convince me. And then Katie's trying out her costumes. But I was like, you know what? I woke up and I said I didn't want to go. So I just not good. I have a hard time making decisions, which you guys probably know by now. But I finally finished most of the work I had to get done today. I still have a little more to do later, but I just changed into my running clothes because I want to go for a run. But before I do that, I just got a notification on my watch that I got some packages delivered. So I'm going to go down and get those. <laughs> I'm actually not regretting my decision at all to not go out because I'm gonna instead go to the movies with Zach. I've been wanting to see that new movie with Florence Pugh and Andrew Garfield. I keep forgetting what it's called, but Zach bought us tickets, so we're gonna go tonight. I will be devouring popcorn and candy, and I think I'll get a good night's sleep and then go to Soul Cycle and I'll be refreshed for a party tomorrow. Oh my god, I literally have a million packages. All my packages got literally soaked, so I love that for me. Perfect. That is hanging. I've never been more disappointed. This is literally so gross. Ugh. I don't even remember what I ordered. I ordered chopsticks. It's soaking wet. There we go. Alright, this is actually soaking. My vitamin C. My iPad case. I just got an iPad. Oh, my eye drops. This is the boringest unboxing of my life. Anyway, I'm gonna quickly throw my hair up and we're gonna head out for a run. I'm just gonna do something short because I have a soul cycle class tomorrow and I don't wanna be really sore. Okay, let's head out on this little run. Hello everyone, I very much flopped at vlogging today. What's new? I literally told myself it wasn't gonna flop, and I flopped. Um, anyway, I just got back from the movies. Me and Zach went together. We saw We Live in a Time. I literally got no vlog footage. But honestly, I didn't think it was as amazing as I thought it was gonna be. It was kind of an average movie. The acting was amazing, don't get me wrong. But actual story, it wasn't my favorite, and I feel lame. I really, really, really thought I was gonna like it. I just got home to an exciting package. It came just in time from Waterboy. I'm literally the biggest fan of Waterboy. You guys know this by now. That's the only shit I trust for curing my Hangover. They sent me the Jenna Palette collab. <gasps> favorite flavor, lemon lime. Don't sleep on it. No one talks about it. It's the best. Oh. I'm so excited. Oh my god, they sent me merch. I've always wanted to get their merch. So cute. Are you kidding me? They ate with that, I fear. Hydration is hot. This is so cute. Wait, I fear I need to try this on right now. Are you kidding me? This is the cutest thing I've ever worn. Okay, I'm gonna quickly change into my pajamas and then we have to assemble Jenna's gift. You guys know Jenna. She's always in the vlog. She's one of my best friends I've met here in Chicago. She is the sweetest. She's an angel. And her birthday's 
I'm gonna see her tomorrow. We're getting coffee in the morning after my soul cycle class. I got her a little gift. I'm gonna show you guys, but let me change really quickly. Who likes my pajamas? It's Zach's uncle's boat. <laughs> he gave me the merch when we went on it in Charleston. The name of the boat's Drug Money, which is so iconic because his wife's a pharmacist. Paid for by Drug Money. Get it? It's actually iconic. I love it. Anyway, I wanna quickly show you guys what I got for Jenna before I give it to her tomorrow. First of all, sweet tarts. I got her this matching necklace and bracelet set. I have the same necklace and I thought it'd be cute if we could twin. So I found her the same one. It's literally so cute. And then I got her the matching bracelet. I love it. Oh my God, it's so cute. But I thought this would go so cute together. Then I found these, which I'm so excited about. It's these cute little wine glasses and they have bows all over them in gold. So yeah, that's what I got her. Okay, wait, I actually think this turned out so cute. And then I'm just gonna write a card before I go to bed and I'll give it to her tomorrow morning but i'm gonna brush my teeth and head to bed it's already 11 12 i'm tired alarm is set for 6 50 a.m i will see you guys bright and early good night So I need to put warmer clothes over this, throw my hair up, and then we can head out. The soul cycle class I'm going to is in downtown, so I have to go all the way to the loop. I've only done cycling like once, like seven years ago at my gym in my hometown. I've never done soul cycle or anything. So I'm actually kind of a little nervous because I'm sore from Orange Theory. <laughs> Set is from Free People. It's actually my new favorite thing. I want it in every color. The waistband, I don't know how to explain it, but this fabric holds so well, so it's perfect for working out. I hate when leggings like slide down, you know? So I highly recommend these. Let's head out. I just waited 15 minutes for the red line and it just simply didn't come. So now I ordered an Uber. I can't function. I've been spending so much money on Uber. It's ridiculous. But I was literally going to be late to the class if I didn't. There were so many delays in the red line. I said I was going to be here for 30 minutes. Are you kidding me? So over this. Hi, where's my driver? For Cora. Thank you, you too. That was not what I was expecting. I had no idea it was like a rave in there. But now I'm walking. I'm going to Tiny Tap Cafe. I'm meeting Jenna there because it's her birthday. And I have the present I brought for her. And I'm so excited to see her. Look how cute this is, you guys. First of all, this view is stunning. Here's Tiny Tap right here. I've always wanted to go. I feel like a fraud that I've lived here for over a year and I've never been. Happy what? birthday! Okay, wait, I have to give you this present. You don't have to open it now. You can if you want. I've never been here. I'm so excited. And I walked right past it because I'm an idiot. Jenna, I didn't know Soul Cycle was a rave. <laughs> I was like so embarrassed. So I was like, I can't do this choreo. Can we get two apple cider donuts? And then can I get an iced cookie butter latte? Thank God you're actually here to get an optimal parking spot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're getting run over. Kenny doesn't know how to parallel car, so mama's taking control. I am master parallel parker. It's my only skill. So every time people come here, I parallel park their cars. Hot shall I do it, ladies? Perfection every time. That was perfect. Thank you. That was the last. My car's all saved. How the weekend has officially begun. We're reunited. Um, I'm so excited. I'm literally a psychopath. <laughs> do that with my hair too but mine's gonna flop i'm probably gonna have to take it out before we go eat <laughs> okay time to head back to the apartment hi we're reunited and we're going to get food no one else is here yeah. yet Halloween weekend baby weekend one because next weekend is also Halloween weekend we're gonna go get food at chipotle before everyone else gets here hi dinner at 3 <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> that pretend like it works so well for all of That eats. Wait, this is scary on you. Why are you hanging this right now? I've been meaning to do it for 10 years. That is not giving. <laughs> I feel like it looks better on me. Yeah, I'll give it back. Here you go. No, I'm not putting it back on. You're not putting it back on? <laughs> Like that. No squish smells were harmed in the making of this. <laughs> I don't know if this is the right size. Yeah, I want, I want. So. Well, let's hope that this is the right size then, huh? Why was it way better on you? That yeah, looks terrible. Yeah. Excuse me, that's rude. Yeah, that's worse really? Why is it not giving? Only gives on you. It gives on her yeah. with the dark hair. Yeah. 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 Y
<laughs> Guys, it's 7 20 p.m. It's like such a shock. It took too long for you to call back. <laughs> Does this look bad? I can't one? even see that. Guys, we have one more shot left. What's this step? Lip, lip, sick. <laughs> Last step, lips. Last shot for Halloween weekend, baby. <laughs> <laughs> and that concludes our get ready with me taking shots. I feel good. I'm ready to take like five more shots. Uh, okay. Now we're gonna get changed into our costume. Costume reveal. Guess who we are? Barton Bellis. Thank you. You don't have to. Hi, my name is Jake Lenamski, and you're watching Disney. <laughs> Whoa, 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 oh, whoa, whoa, yeah, yeah, whoa, whoa, yeah, oh, my God. it's fucking hot in this <laughs> How's everyone doing? It's been a while, I miss you. Do you miss me? Cause we miss you. Okay, you guys, we're gonna do the Bella's TikTok. Everyone enjoy programming. We are here, we have Zach, we have Steven, Badger game, and we have the ladies working. Pretty much it, guys, it's lit, it's a party. Mm. Woo! Life, as you can see, he's pissed because I'm standing in front of the TV, but I'm not gonna move because I know he needs it. Oh my god, this is crazy! How are you doing that? You're crazy, that's insane! Oh my god! It's water. <laughs> I'm pretty black today! Talk it like a talk it. It's water. Okay, that's real, so. Oh! Absolutely not. I'm your first of vlogger. It's a little bit of <laughs> Who do you think's gonna get the drunkest tonight? Uh, you. Okay. <laughs> okay, John, who do you think's gonna be the drunkest tonight? I think Pharaoh's gonna get the drunkest. Steven? Yeah. Who's gonna get the drunkest tonight? Yeah, the Mike Rouse, he didn't make it here. Yeah, he literally didn't make it, so he's lost. Who's gonna get the drunkest tonight, Zach? Or... Me? Why is everybody saying that? Single and ready to mingle. What do you have to say? <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, this is Jack. And I'm just a platypus. This is my best friend for life ever. We were immediately bonded the moment that we met. Yes, when I realized that you were a. I'm cutting that out. <laughs> Shot with Harry and Carmelo. I love that. No diggity. I gotta bag it up. No diggity. I gotta bag it up. Dance on here. What the fuck, bro? What the fuck? You just can't have sponsorship for a new one. Damn. <laughs> Guys, get in. Oh, oh, you know what? No. Five, six, seven, eight. Na 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 You are the music and all the music. <laughs> Killing me when I hear my favorite song, I know you're 
black. Photo shoot in front of Wrigley. What about it? Now look up his Batman if he was wondering. <laughs> what the f is he doing what running into this? Dumb if you want to see Cora as sexy Batman, follow me on Instagram. Wait, this morning. is how I woke up. Thank you. <laughs> I've been thinking about Redo it, redo it. Yeah, it's not gonna be a little surprise. I know, obviously. Why would I redo it if you're recording? Go. Hey. <laughs> Playing. No. <laughs> <laughs> he's locked out. Yeah. He just hung up on Zach and he's locked out. Hello? What do you want me to do? It's what? Oh, it's, it's working, it's working. Hi. Uh, <laughs> I can't pop. Hi. Unmute. I did put you in. I'm literally Dude. disgusted. Okay. Cora's bad at her job yet again. Well, my body's been a mess. And I miss your jeans. I'm literally looking at the wall. Oh, wow. Whoa. Your hair is going to be matted from that time. No, my, my hair's going to protect me. <laughs> <laughs> What do you say? I don't know. Oh, you said someone's gonna pay you. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Where's my phone? I already lost it again. Act like you're on the bathroom. This is Ryan Sutz. He's from Oak Park, Illinois. He plays soccer and he's single. If anyone's interested. <laughs> There's nothing else to say. Oh.